Hey everyone, this is Angel. Um, today I wanted to talk a little bit about your post-workout nutrition and why it's so important and why Shakeology is a good choice for post-workout nutrition. I actually get those questions a lot when um, people are wondering when they should drink their Shakeology and I always tell them I actually I work out in the mornings so I kind of double it up as both uh, meal replacement as my breakfast and my post-workout fuel as well. Um, the reason that post-workout nutrition is so important is because your body needs to recover uh, what it just lost by exercising. Um, and it's better at storing that recovery fuel within your first 15 minutes post-workout. Um, this is actually because the enzymes that help your body to resynthesize mus muscle glycogen are most active within that 15 minute time frame. So that is the most important time that you want to try to get in your post-workout nutrition, but if you can't, um, you want to do it at least within an hour. Um, because the longer you wait, the longer it takes to recover. When you work out, Afterwards, your body is in a state of depletion because, like I said, you just lost a lot. I mean, you just sweat. Your muscles are breaking down because you just used them. So it's really, really important to actually refuel your body after that. The big problem that a lot of people have is that they take in too many calories with their post-workout nutrition. Um, you don't want to take in any more than 100 to 250. And Shakeology... It, it falls right in that. It's 120 to 170 calories, I think, is the most. And when you mix it with other things, too, you just don't want to go over about 250, um, which isn't that hard. So it's a great choice calorie-wise. Um, you also need protein and carbs afterwards. You want to kind of go by a ratio of 4 to 1 for post-workout nutrition, four to one being carbs to proteins. Um, for example, the chocolate shake allergy, which you guys all know that I love, um, it has 17 grams of carbs and 17 grams of protein. So in order to make that four to one ratio work, you would need about 68 grams of protein, and you can do that by adding in some fruit. And then mixing it with water and ice, and I always throw in greens as well just for a little added nutrition, not that you really need it with it. <laughs> um, and the protein is also especially important um, because it repairs your muscles. It has, the, depending on the flavor that you drink, it has between 16 and 18 grams of protein. And um, the protein is so important because it's made out of amino acids, which is the base component of what muscle is made out of. Um, the carbs are important because it helps promote muscle growth and it also aids in recovery just like protein does. Um, so many people always are thinking that they need to replenish their electrolytes by using sports nutrition drinks. Um, the problem with those is that they're also loaded with a lot of sugars, which you don't want. Shake Allergy is actually, it does have sugar in it, but it's all from natural foods, um, fruits and vegetables. Uh, it doesn't have any added extra sugars. And it's low on the glycemic index, which is also great for people with um, diabetes. But in reference to the electrolytes, all of the nutrition that is in it, um, the magnesium, the sodium, vitamins, minerals, and the enzymes are actually is what are actually going to help replenish your body of those electrolytes. So throw out those sugar-filled um, electrolyte drinks and find something that actually, or you know, just drink shake algae, um, and find something that has the nutrition that you need without the extra stuff that you don't. So. I'm not saying that you have to drink shake algae after you work out. Um, a lot of people just use it as a meal replacement, which is great. It's actually what it's intended to, do, to be used for because it is um, so important for 
weight loss and um, that's I mean that's part of it is using it as a meal replacement like I said I use mine kind of as both because it kind of doubles as breakfast and um, post-workout drink a lot but if you don't have Shakeology or if you prefer to use it um, as a meal replacement for just breakfast or just lunch or something like that um, I actually recommend Vega because this it's not filled with a bunch of crap that you would find in a lot of other protein shakes. Um, it's, again, it's a lot of uh, the things that you need to help repair your body with uh, protein and carbs, but minus the extra added sugars. And um, the only thing is that it doesn't have the added nutrition that Shakeology does. So I want you all to... Comment below with what you're work using for your post-workout shakes or drinks or foods and um, kind of compare it in your mind to what I just went over. And as always, like, comment, subscribe, and add me on Facebook. You guys know you'll be seeing me again next week, so have a good one.